Hey, welcome back to Triple R. Today we have the wolf with us. Thanks for being here. Appreciate your time. Um, Hello, Rick. <laughs> hey, man. So where the where the wolf come about? I know I seen you on Facebook before. What, what's the wolf up to these days? And where where'd you come from? Well, I always been around. Always, I just decided to actually catch myself on video one day. Mm -hmm. It's true. I was just like. One day at Home Depot or Lowell's, and I saw my likeness, and I decided that, you know what? It's time for the wolf. It's the season of the wolf. Season of the wolf. Yeah. All right. Season of the wolf. All right. Um, so what, what's your top three werewolf movies? Top three werewolf movie. Well, we got to go old school with the old school joint, The Wolfman, Black and White. All right. The classic, the beginning. You always have to. If the if the beginning is not in your top three, then it's not a top three. <laughs> okay. Then my second favorite is American Werewolf in London. Best transformation since me. <laughs> that's a great transformation scene. That is. Yes. That is. That's that's a good movie. Definitely. It's surprisingly rather dark for a comedy, and I like dark. That's when I come out at night. Mm -hmm. yeah. Full moon, right? Yes, full moon. I don't wait for the full moon. That's is not a correct assumption. Oh, that's, that's right. You're just a wolf. You're yeah. a werewolf. I am. Yeah, I'm a bear wolf. A bear wolf. Bear. <laughs> ha! Yes. <laughs> Woo! Right. And then my last, fa my la other favorite is the. Howling, which is also feature a fantastic transformation. It does. It hey, does. it is scary. No one ever thought about a wolf serial killer. That was a great idea. So, right, that was my dad, by the way. No, oh. that's your dad in the movie. Yeah, you know. I don't know. I guess maybe when I think werewolf movies, maybe Twilight, Teen Wolf, uh, Silver uh, Bullet. <laughs> being a proper wolf, I shall not uh, curse, but... <laughs> you can feel the rage Twilight. coming through the screen, man. I'm just joking about Twilight. It's terrible. It's terrible. Twilight story. is just... I don't, I don't know what that was. No one knows what that was. No one. No one. <laughs> <laughs> And a silver bullet. You don't think that I can't catch a kid in a wheelchair? Where are you going? It's like he's in the woods on a wheelchair. All sorts of things in his round, and all of a sudden he got the wolf. Mm -mm, I don't think so. What's the wolf's top three video games? Top three video game. Well, I like that Injustice god amongst us the story is fantastic it's like a movie and and the combinations can be complicated i'm not answering that that's little red calling me again she won't leave me alone she still thinks i ate her grandmother grandmother is in witness protection program from her little red on speed dial so uh, and my other ones are both war games, you know, Call of Duty and Medal of Honor for PS2. That's the one that set all the other war games in motion. And that's the one with the, the beach, taking the beach, right? Yeah, I don't know. Normandy felt like being there. I know what I mean. I made a lot of money on Wall Street. That's how I'm able to do whatever I want to do because, yes, I am that wolf. I am the wolf of Wall Street. No, all right. That's true. So independently That's true. wolf, do what he wants. <laughs> all right, so there's your video games, your movies. Uh, what about any board yeah. games or card games? Well, primarily, what I primarily do is prowl. Oh, <laughs> it's on the prowl. I do that broke or with my... Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Checking to see if there's a full moon. 
I got some humans that like to try to pretend to be us. Oh, okay. Speaking of werewolves, what, what about what do you think on what do you think about the Underworld movies, the Underworld series? <sighs> they could be better. They could be. You know, first of all, it's vampire centric. That's crap. <laughs> it should be wolf center. It's bias. It's completely bias. Who are the slaves? Huh? Huh? The wolf. Yeah, yeah, that's We're true. the most powerful creature on the planet, and we supposedly slave to dead humans? I don't think so. That's a good point. I'm trying to think, is there a werewolf movie where you guys are in charge of vampires? I haven't seen it. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> no. No, we should be in charge of a few things. Yeah, man. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> so that, that's a familiar, familiar um, cry there. Is that your favorite wrestler? No, I made it up myself. Mm -hmm. You made that he up yourself. He patterned himself after me. No. Oh. I've been around for century. Okay. Me, the three bears. We were all pals. Until one day, Papa Bear stole my idea from only you can prevent forest fire. <laughs> he went for the interview and got the job. That was my line. So Smokey. That's his real name. Smokey Papa Bear. Yeah, all right. All right, Smokey Papa Bear. So he sold out, huh? That, yeah, sold out. Him and the three pigs all conspired against me. That's why I don't like pigs. Everybody blamed me in the three pig story. You know, it's like I huffed and I puffed and I blew the house down. I used to sit there and knock on the door and say, little pigs, little pigs, let me in. But then I discovered the magic words to get in every single time. Oh, yeah? I just knocked on the door and say, trick or tree and they open it right up <laughs> yeah, I guess uh, they would. at least once, once, a, once a year they would i guess no you can do it too many pigs not that smart you could probably try candy gram <laughs> <laughs> that's how really the wolf came to be to tell you quite honestly to set the story straight of Little Red Riding Hood from my point of view. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, that was Three Pigs. Oh. Riding Hood is something else. Right. Well, they're the same people, they're the same story. I dealt with the Three Pigs, and after I got singed a little bit, I became a vegetarian, and then Little Red was on her way to Grandma's house to knock her off. So I took a shortcut and I said, hey, Grandma, Little Red is coming to knock you away. Go hide. Wait, she was gonna, wait, wait, wait. wait. Like, she was going to knock her grandma off. Was there like an <laughs> insurance scam or something? Insurance. Yep. Yep. You got it. Okay. They don't tell you about that part. So I lay there and I waited. And then she started asking me all sorts of questions when she came in. Like she was an, uh, an uh, what is it called? An anatomy student how big my eyes were, how big my ears were. I think she was trying to line me up to make me into soup. Oh. And then her boyfriend just bust through the door. The ax man, the type of dude that chop first and ask questions later. So nobody ever in I laid in a hospital for weeks. <laughs> weeks, man. Well, you made it. That's good, man. You made it. Yeah. And so I came out to the world to tell my story. That's good to know both sides, man. You know, it's always good to know both sides, but there's only one side, my side. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All, right. Mm -hmm. All right, man. Is there anything you want to tell the people before we sign off here? Not really. I just um, I hope you stay safe and woof out. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Woo! <laughs>
Hey, thanks, Wolf, for being here. Appreciate your time. All right, this is Triple R, everybody. Take care. Yes. Thank you.